I came to Fairmont because I love the passion and the love for the sport of football here at this school and all the coaching staff and I met some of the players when I came here. It was a great vibe here, so I know there's a lot of passion to the football when we want to do anything to win and get the conference title and rings on our fingers. Well, the vibe was in the locker room that we had to go out there and get a win no matter what. And we was already one loss down in our conference. And Glenn was a big rival in our conference, so we had to go out there and get the win. Week long, coach emphasized strongly on how McCann's is a strong arm. And the receivers are taught to keep running under the ball, so we had to stay on our toes, keep eyes open, like to get to the middle of the field, the middle post, into the sidelines and go verticals. And McCann's rolled out to the sideline, and I seen a receiver coming across the middle, so I matched up with him. And I broke on the pass when McCann stood it, picked it off. I was looking for blockers, but I took off in front. And I was cutting back across the green. I hit a lineman that I didn't see, and I couldn't juke past him. And I bounced off of him, and then Stroh Snyder led me into the end zone. It's a little bit of relief, but we knew what we could do. We just had to go out there and finish the game. Like, we start the game sometimes, then we don't finish them strong. We just had to get together mentally and flip the switch. That's going to be our biggest challenge yet with the passing game. We have some other QBs that were challenges, but this QB for West Liberty is going to be a big challenge for our defense. So we have to be very disciplined and get to our assignments and alignments and make plays on the ball.